Mexico with a gun to my head. What a cry baby. The story takes place, and most of it takes place in Mexico. It's actually shooted in the real environment. It was so helpful. And beyond that, it's just such a beautiful country. Our crew was so skilled. They were absolutely lovely and very, very patient with me. <laughs> we all came back missing it. That's the guy from the plaza. The one with the shoulder holster. Stop the car. Mexico is a great place. It feels very right to be shooting the film here, and I can tell that we are huge beneficiaries of Mexico. I've been very fortunate to shoot several of the films I've done in the actual location they're set, and there's nothing more satisfying than that. You're not having to fake it, you're not having to imagine what it would be like to be in Mexico City or in Veracruz, you're literally there. I find when I'm making something, I try and be very open to the surroundings and the people I'm meeting and just let those infuse into what I'm making. The locations of the airport, the types of cars, the types of people, trying to keep the authenticity. When you look at the architecture of Chicago and the architecture of Mexico, you just see this vast difference. And so the movie pops in different places. Chicago will feel very different. And then even within Mexico, Veracruz will feel very different than Mexico City. The film's set in Chicago, LA, and Mexico, and Mexico has been one of the best discoveries. It's important for me the cast be very international. That's the, the world I live in. Nash, as a director, he's got a very good eye for the right sort of tone when it comes to casting actors. Coming down to Mexico and wanting to cast as many local people as he could. We do a beautiful scene, actually. Elaine and I go down to the factory and we have a sit down with the guy who's running the factory for us down there, Sanchez, who is an incredible local actor. And he let us know while we were in the middle of shooting the scene that this was the first time he'd ever shot a scene in English. We told you to cut him off. With all due respect, that's not the way it works. You can't scare me with tales of the big bad cartels, right? I don't know how things work. Not in Mexico. And I was like, oh boy, well, like if I tried to uh, shoot my first scene in Spanish, it would be a mess. There's so many wonderful Mexican actors in the film. Carlos Corona, who plays Viegas, and Hernan Mendoza, who plays Sanchez. Like, those two guys, I cast them separately, and then it turned out they'd worked together a lot before. ¿Dónde está la fórmula del producto? En una caja fuerte a la que no tengo acceso y se necesita huella digital. ¿La huella de quién? De Jar. I don't dare! Come on! No, Carol! I want, no! I did a lot of research on the carnival in the area we're in, Veracruz. There's so many carnivals in Mexico, and I think it's really important that we're doing that regional carnival and, and that, those masks and those images. And of course, you have all these wonderful filmmakers coming out of Mexico, so the infrastructure for film here is really amazing. They're one of the best international crews I've ever worked with, actually. Crews are fantastic. Uh, obviously, Mexico has its own incredible cinematic tradition. I enjoy being in Mexico, and I love the sort of vitality of the culture. And in a way, everyone is an artist here. It's really great people, very warm, very loving. Yeah.